Happy Monk Day, everybody. Happy Monk Day. Happy Monk Day. At this particular time marker, at this particular geospatial location that I'm finding myself at, the people around me who buy into a particular cultural operating system are celebrating their country today. Yay, country! Go, country! But it, of course, goes much deeper than that, because both date as well as country are representations, and they're representations of our super ego, mm -hmm. of daddy. Mm -hmm. Remember a few weeks ago when we celebrated Father's Day? I talked about how the Latin words mater and pater, for mother and father, gave us matern and pattern, right? And pattern is imprinted upon matter to create things like you. So here we are celebrating patterns. And let's look at those two patterns, right? Here's date. And the date pattern was given to us by the church. It was people who observed the cycles of nature and they saw certain rhythms and so they created a pattern called calendar. Mm -hmm. And it works pretty well. It allows us to meet and read each other at certain times and make sure that we're coordinated. But it's a pattern and it works pretty well even though we have to adjust it a couple of years every couple of years by a day just to make it work. Mm -hmm. What about country? Right? In about 10 days or so, some other country is going to celebrate La Patria, their fatherland. Patria, patriotism. Right? But until a few hundred years ago, we didn't have nations really. That was a new thing. Before then, the biggest pattern that people could identify with was their clan or family. And then it became the Vaterland. Vaterland in German, the fatherland, right? Because it's not the motherland. It's Vaterland in the sense of something that is created through a social contract. La Patrie, United States, whatever, are all created and based originally on social contracts. Because Mother Nature is always there. Gaia has no boundaries, right? And we know that now, in the 21st century, which is why it's important to kill and revive or bring to life again this concept of patriotism. Because if you take the current one and you just expand it beyond these boundaries, then it's imperialism. And remember that empire in a long, long distant galaxy somewhere away had an evil man behind it and Darth Vader. To administer it. Dark father, right? He's a dark father who gives you patterns that control you. And it's important to have discernment and boundaries. That's what daddy is all about. But we have new patterns now. We know that there is a globe where the only dividing lines are oceans and continental divides. But beyond that, mm -mm, all arbitrary lines, arbitrary choices made a while ago. And with each of them having social contracts that are slowly but surely eroding. So now, let them die. And create a new social contract. One for this new pattern of a global community, a global family, a global country. Let's be planetary citizens. Planetary patriotism. Happy Monday!